This technology is the very precipice of a revolutionary change to how we fight future wars. What the NGCV means to the future of war fighting is it's not, it is not an evolutionary change where it's not an increment. We're not just going to be able to shoot further and see the enemy quicker. It's going to revolutionize the way we fight. So phase one is all about validating the man to man teaming concept. Uh, what we're trying to do here is develop the baseline uh, tactics, techniques, and uh, procedures that we can use to transition to uh, units for them to further expand upon and validate the concept of robotic warfare. Well, the first platform is called the MET-D, the Mission Enabling Tech Demonstrator. What that is, is it serves two purposes. The first purpose is to serve as a control vehicle for the robotic control vehicle. The next purpose is it serves as a way for us to demonstrate new emerging technologies from the ST realm, validate them, gain soldier feedback. The other platform is a surrogate for the robotic combat vehicle. But ultimately what this is, is just a vehicle for us to give to soldiers and let them demonstrate with unmanned ground combat vehicles in an actual live experiment for the first time.